you're tuned into PACA Live. A quick announcement before we get going. PACA's next big production will be PACA Palooza, celebrating our 10-year anniversary, August 12th through the 14th. More information will be available at our website, PACA1505.org. But without further ado, I would love to welcome to the PACA Live stage, Graham I Am. Your horn ain't blowing. 
Justin Gears faster than Jeff Gordon. You've got a full tank of gasoline and a half a pack of cigarettes. And when you stall, you'll smoke the And the one before that was somewhere around 1990-ish. I wrote this song in 94. I had to relearn it. I used to be in a power pop punk grunge band, Mr. Pink. And uh, wrote this song, made on a record, but never really did it live. So I had to relearn it just for you. Uh, this is about my friend Jason who had the killer stereo, so this is about his stereo. Let's get the chords right. Whenever I listen to time, thoughts of you come to mind. And a secret we never knew We always knew when you were there The ground was shaken And we could hear the dead for miles away Now the music doesn't play Now that you're not around are down and it's quiet in the neighborhood quiet in the neighborhood it's quiet in the neighborhood quiet in the neighborhood you'll never again turn me on favorite song, the lights no longer glow red, all circuits are dead, now that you're not around, all systems are down, and it's quiet in the neighborhood, quiet in the neighborhood, it's quiet in the neighborhood. Competing in a bar, I can actually play some more intimate songs than normal. Usually, when I'm playing, it's so loud and everybody's playing pool. And so, I'm gonna try one I've not used to playing. Not used to playing standing up. Let's see how I can do this. <clears throat> That's it, only 10 minutes. Chris. 
Christine Unbound makes me want her. Christine Unfound forever she'll be pristine. Christine Untouched. Pristine. Christine Untouched. Gracias. Grazie. Okay, now comes the fun part of the night. I get to try and play some piano that I haven't played in years. Last time I played this instrument, it was Rocky Horror. Uh, but I'm going to play some stuff. I'm going to see if I can get this one right. I wrote this when I was in like seventh grade, I think. to be in the Bach and stuff, so.
And then, and then, see, I used to play the piano all the time when I was in high school. I actually missed the bus the first day of school two years in a row because I was playing piano. And you'd never know it now because I don't, I had to relearn the instrument. Uh, here's another one I wrote when I was in high schoolish, right about the time I met the love of my life. I'll raise my glass to that one. All right. We'll try this one more time. Woo! Something like that. Yeah, trying to relearn things that you wrote when you were a teenager is very difficult. But I did write this next one in 94. I wrote a lot in 94. I was apparently and uh, in my power pop punk grunge band, Mr. Pink, where we were loud guitars. squeeze a piano piece in there. So this is a piano piece that's never been performed live. This is a first for everybody. It's late at night and the bar is closing and there is me and there is you. I catch a glimpse Get alone as I walk home. 
It's late at night and the bar is closing and there is me and there is you. I was waiting for crickets to chirp there. It's actually called Night of the Dentist. Another instrumental from high school. Or thereabouts. 88, 89, somewhere in that range. When I used to play all the Beethoven or Bach stuff, that stuff, I would hit a wrong chord. And go, ooh, that sounds good. What can I do with it? song from 1994. Apparently 94 was a prolific year for me, but I wrote this song in D minor because it's the saddest of all keys. Yeah. D minor, it's the saddest of all keys. It's called Lick My Love Pump. <laughs> Spinal Tap reference. Hey, and I wrote this song before I got into construction. Broken, I was 
was playing charades I thought I was the master jack of all trades With good intentions though my methods corrupt I didn't repair things I just covered them up I just covered them up I just covered them up With bobby pins and butter knives can fix toasters but they can't fix lives and although universal love meets demise when it can't be fixed with bobby pins or butter knives bobby pins or butter knives bobby pins or butter knives with bobby pins or butter knives with bobby pins or butter Apparently, I like to do those little flourishes at the end. Why not? Speaking of flourishes, so uh, every once in a while, I like to write an exercise just to keep my fingers limber. I kind of wrote this one. The trick of it is to actually get faster as I go down, but we'll see what happens. It's also fun when you close your eyes and try to play it. It's just fun to try to do that. I won't bore you with it again. What's on the list? Oh! Okay. Uh, I wrote this on. See, I never used to date my songs, and then I started getting to the point where I would write at least write the month, and then I got even more specific, but I wrote this on March 7th, 1998. <laughs> Okay, enough goofing around, let's talk more rock. Last a day, been so long, but if. If 
so thankful every day for Miss Mouse. Thank you. Well, I got uh, two more here to do on the Piana, on the electric banana. If I were to have a television show, and I wish I did, this would be my TV theme. I can't, I can't do the ticky thing. <gasps> this is my theme song. My theme song. I should have played this in the beginning. Except I can't get the tick tick sound I want. This should be like a... theme song. <clears throat> All right, this next song is one of the last songs that I've written, and that was like five years ago, so I haven't done produced anything. But uh, I wrote it on guitar and transposed it, transcribed it, transposed, transcribed, transcribed to piano. So I'm going to try this. This has never been performed live on a piano. <coughs> Everybody thinks they know what this is about. Ah, let me do that again. It's a beautiful night, and you look your best, and your face is aglow, and you're wearing that dress that hugs you so well. Might as well be called a sin And I can't take my eyes off As you cross the room And you're glancing at me As they play our tune But both of us know That you're going home with him with 
instead So I want to know If you're letting it go Cause there's no glow anymore in your eyes When you look at me Getting here towards the end of the night. There you go. Now for something completely different. Yeah, here we go. <clears throat> I remember the words. Choking down a cigarette and choking down a beer. Kicking up a dusty road with a roach clip from the mirror. Shotgun shells by my side in case someone needs saved. I got both boots on my feet, one foot in the grave. Monday night it's Mary Lou and Tuesday night it's Jane. Such a sin. How can I be saved when I drink and smoke and I play guitar and I make love out under the stars? I got both boots on my feet, but one foot in the grave. Mama taught me how to fight and Papa how to love and both not to break a woman's heart. Don't make a fuss because I cuss. It won't be long until I'm rust. I got 
sleazy bars. I got both boots on my feet, one foot in the grave. Oh, and I, when I use up all my glory days, and in case there is a heaven, yeah, when the preacher puts me in the ground. You gotta call it Missouri, because if it, you know, otherwise you're in misery. I do not recommend that state. I don't care if I'm on the internet. You know where you are. <clears throat> it's like the center of the country just gets dumber. Okay. Uh, so I, <clears throat> when I was down there, I played in this uh, band called Swing Grass. The guy who wrote stuff he used to write things a lot like this, so when I came back... In January of 2010... <clears throat> I kind of stole a little bit of his uh, thing here. I got rocks inside my head got shit for brains, put them together and they go crazy, you're angry all the time and I'm just mad, we work so hard at being lazy. Which is good because I only got a couple songs left that should take about eight and a half minutes. Wow, that's very precise. 
I write short songs. That's how you get more in. But I have to switch guitars. <laughs> Not if Dave did his job right. Today's Juneteenth, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Happy Juneteenth, world. February 19th, 2000, at 1.32 a.m. <laughs> That's when I finish it. When I finish a song, I'll write down the, the exact time. And if I do modifications, I amend it.
takes a lot to make the world go round. We spend our lives going in circles. Just the blink of an eye in the scheme of things. Just specks of dust that we call human beings. So far out, yet with both feet firmly on the ground. We scream and shout, yet make no sound. Spinning round. song for the evening so if you're going to end a song you might as well do it with a cover so this is my only cover of the night on the cover of the night for those of you who know the Rolling Stones all right <clears throat> want to thank dig it Dave Schroeder here for all those good work and hard work Come on, you can clap louder than that. There we go. All those people at home, you have to clap too. Just because you're watching on a computer doesn't mean you can't clap for Dave. Woo! I'm sorry I don't know you, so I didn't introduce you. What's his name? Sav. Sav. That's right, Lone Sav. Lone like, put some Sav on that. <laughs> Uh, <coughs> I'm old, man. Okay, uh, this next song will go out to all of my friends out in computer land who are like uh, B. Thornton, maybe, if he's watching, and Bloom, and all the old Mr. Pink people, people from my past. <sighs> Desecrate you. You let 
letting it penetrate you. You let me complicate you. Thank you, Cleveland. Good night.